<sighs> I'm much more suited to leisurely days like these. I'd love to, cutie. Hmm, too bad I can't offer you some tea. I was quite surprised to learn that the Grand Master had written a private message just for me. And I was equally surprised to find out that Razor's been on his mind this whole time. Especially given how demanding he is of Jean. He left her to figure out the whole Vine Lisa Fest on her own, and didn't give her a single word of acknowledgement. I'll have to have a stern word with him on Jean's behalf when he returns. <sighs> I'm much more suited to leisurely days like these. I'd love to, cutie. Hmm, too bad I can't offer you some tea. It's funny, I always thought the Grand Master was the one who gave him the name Razor. But it turns out his birth parents chose it all along. Huh. Anyway, Razor told me he heard the voices of his parents during the festival. Like stepping on a rock in the sun. Warm, but also heavy. <sighs> I'm sure he must think of them as both kind and dauntless people. <sighs> I'm much more suited to leisurely days like these. I'd love to, cutie. Originally, I only planned on having a glass or two. I thought I deserved a treat after being such a good teacher recently. But that was before I came to appreciate how truly exceptional the festival-exclusive vintage was. Before I knew it, I was already rather tipsy. <laughs> I'm a bad example. Don't be like me, cutie. I'm much more suited to leisurely days like these. All right, but remember, it's important to rest when you're feeling tired. It makes my heart ache to see you so busy all the time. <sighs> 